Why should you learn new things while doing photography? Let's talk about it. So why should you learn new things in photography? You do something once, you're good at it, people like what you're doing, why should you just not just stay like that? Well the reason is, is because if you learn new things, you might learn that you like doing other things more than these things that you're doing now. For example, if you look at my Instagram feed, by the way, follow Hazography on Instagram, you can see, as you're seeing on screen right now, I've been trying to do more black and white photography. When I first started, as you can see at the bottom, I didn't like doing black and white photography, I didn't know what I was doing. And then I started about a few weeks ago, so I can make this video, or well, I should be saying I started a week ago, so I can make this video, saying that I can do now black and white photography, and I actually enjoy doing black and white photography, and sometimes I prefer now black and white photography, as you can see from my last like four or five photos, they're all in black and white photography. And the reason I like black and white photography, it's a different form of nature photography. It shows a different side of it. Black and white photography, it shows a deeper, I guess, a deeper idea of the photo, if that makes sense. It shows it's a different meaning of photography. That's what I'm trying to say. In nature photography, yes, color is extremely important because it can show so many different things and you're showing the nature. However, in certain photos, black and white can show a completely different perspective on it and make the photo completely different and maybe if two people might like it better or you, more importantly, might like it better considering you are your biggest critic when photos. By the way, don't forget that. You are your biggest critic and you will judge the photo the most probably besides critics because those people are, uh, their job is that you criticize your work. Anyways. Expanding your skill set in photography is extremely important for you doing posts, even in just for yourself and post production, because doing the same thing over and over again is, can get repetitive and can get boring for you. Therefore, if you do different things, it makes the work different. It makes it more exciting, I guess you can say. More different, if I keep saying different, but it makes it more exciting, makes it make more enjoyable for yourself. That's what I'm trying to say, enjoyable. Also, if you get a better skill set of post-production photography in any photography field, that means you can, you know, if you get a job in photography as a freelance photographer or just as a job photographer, it means you can do more for the client and that will make the client happier and possibly for you to get more jobs and for your photos to be more better, probably. I don't know, it depends on you really, and how good you are at the camera and the post-production and all that stuff. Okay. I've got a little bit of a visitor here that's just ruined recording. You wanna get out of camera? Yes, you do. Oh, look at her. Hey. Look at her. Look. There. What are you on? It's over there. Yeah. Anyways. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and all that stuff. Say hi to Doggy. Bye.